have a lot of cousins who are teachers and just kind of seeing the way that they've been in, able to inspire um, other people to want to learn to read books. Um, they inspired me to love reading when I was younger and I just wanted to pass on that love to other people. I was inspired to become a teacher because I really believe in the democratic purposes of schools and I really think that teachers are foundational to our democracy and for um, cultivating democratic tenets among young people, showing young people that their voices matter and that collectively they can make changes both within classrooms and within society. And I think that um, being a member of, of that collective is really important and inspiring to me. Well, what inspired me to become a teacher was that I grew up in a, in a uh, school setting uh, where I had teachers that, that never understood me. I only spoke uh, Spanish. And so my goal was to become a teacher who could help students who, um, who could relate to their teachers. I think being a teacher came really naturally to me because there are so many teachers in my family. So you could say that my inspiration for becoming a teacher was both my grandmother and my mother who were teachers, but then also I knew a woman who was teaching eighth grade and she believed in me and she let me have an, a chance teaching her class. That was the very first class I ever taught. I wasn't trained to be a teacher at all, but I just wanted to know kind of how it felt to be in a classroom full of kids. Yeah, so I was inspired to become a teacher uh, because the teachers that were powerful influences on me cared not just about what I was learning about, but cared about me, my personal development and growth. Um, and one of the reasons I really wanted to become a teacher is because it was a great excuse to keep learning forever and ever and ever, um, while also making an impact on people that might benefit from learning with you. I was inspired to become a teacher because of my passion for writing in middle school. And as I was in high school, it wasn't fostered. I didn't keep writing creatively. So that inspired me to become an English teacher because I want to foster those future creative writers. My favorite English teacher inspired me through choice in my reading. Um, my first inspiration to be a teacher was from my parents. My mother is a, was a high school English teacher for many, many years. And my father was a college English professor. and. Um, they always had so much energy and every time we went out in the town, I grew up in a fairly small town, but everybody would know them, everybody would talk to them, and people would talk to my mother especially about how much she had influenced them or influenced their children. Well, what inspired me to become a teacher was kind of an accident, actually. I was working as a graduate assistant at the local university, getting a, um, a master's at that time in English, and part of my requirements were to teach a freshman comp class. I found that I connected well with my students and I really enjoyed teaching. I would have never in a million years thought that I would end up as a teacher. My favorite teacher was my sixth grade teacher, Ms. Barry. And that was back when sixth grade was still in elementary school. So she had us all day, which I'm sure was a daunting task because I have taught sixth grade now and I know what sixth graders can be like. Um, and what I remember from her is how much she cared about all of us as people. And that's what I want to do for my students as well. Well, uh, what inspired me to become a teacher was my mother. She was an English teacher and my grandmother was a Spanish teacher. And those were my two favorite teachers. But my mom always had such a joy at, at when she'd come home from teaching. She always smiling, always happy and had the cutest stories to tell. And I thought, wow, that'd be fun just to be, you know, go into a classroom and be there for a, a career. And that's what I did. My mom had a stroke and uh, I took care of her for seven years. And while I was doing that, I was going to college at the same time. And, uh, and I just wished that I was able to talk to her more before she couldn't speak after that. And well... Anyway, she's my favorite English teacher, and she loved English, and when I was small, we'd read chapters from Treasure Island or uh, Great Expectations or something like that. Mom, Mama was a big reader, and so am I. What inspired me to become a teacher were the lasting memories that were created when I was a student. Um, and some of those you know, elements that I want to take with me into my own practice include loving students, uh, being supportive 
and also, you know, sharing in some learning alongside of them.